My work comes from the things that I go through in my life. The good, the bad, and the ugly. When something happens in my life, the, where I go to is to my work. Because it's the only thing that allows me to move forward. I am totally convinced that photography has the ability to tell you something if you spend the time looking at it. You know, it's part of who we are. The way that I, that I work, I think on my creative process, I have a lot of questions all the time. Um, I'm also a very curious individual, and I think that, that as an artist, if you have that sense of curiosity, I think it's an asset in many ways. I'm Cuban born, and I never had the opportunity to grow up in, my, in the country where I was born. My parents were 23-year-old kids with three girls, of which I'm the youngest, and I was only three months old when we left Cuba. And, but for my parents, photographs were really, really important because that's how they would tell us a story of a life that we didn't, that we didn't know, or a family member that we have never met. I'm a Cuban-born, Puerto Rican-grown American citizen. And the three identities have had an impact on the way that I think and the way that I relate to the outside world uh, completely. Um, so it's a black background. This will be one. I've been doing photography since I was a kid. I just was never good at anything but that. I had the passion since I was very little with it, because it, it hooked me. I came here when, when Miami was not the Miami that it is today. What Miami offered me was the isolation and the tranquility of doing my work at peace without so, many, so much interruption and then having my family here also uh, with me. But there were artists here, and I look up to them. When Dennis called me to let me know that I have received this award, one of the greatest things that he mentioned to me, and I will never forget, is that I was not given this award only because of my work. I was given this award also because of what I have given back to the community. <laughs>